This is all of Rosette Sire's extended family that will gather this Christmas. Her son went to the occupied West Bank three years ago and never came back. He took his two sons, worried for their future here in Gaza. One of her daughters moved to Canada six years ago. Life is very difficult in Gaza. We live under siege and we cannot move anywhere. Gaza has become a big prison. We've witnessed many wars. During the bombing, we had to sleep in the church for safety. The story of Rosette's family is typical among Gaza's small community of Christians. They gather in just three churches. Congregations are shrinking. Their population's just over a thousand. It was more than double that ten years ago when the blockade by Israel and Egypt began. They suffer the same daily struggles as the Muslim majority, but sociologists say Christian families tend to have more means to get out. Christian family in Gaza usually has high, high uh, socio-economic level. And I think the more the human being has uh, options and the more has money and he look to the, to, the, to the better life and good life. And this is good life is not available in Gaza. Even you are, has money in Gaza, but you can't lead a happy life. And adding to the strife is the U.S. recognition of Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. Here in this community center, Christians are holding a vigil in solidarity for Jerusalem as Palestine's capital. The feeling among the Christian community is very much the same as it is among the Muslim majority. Everyone we've spoken to here is in opposition to the US move and they say it only adds to the frustrations of life here. There are many Muslims here too. The communities coexist. Issa Sabah runs the center. He says they do everything they can to try and provide support for all young people. They cannot do what they need or what they must uh, do in their life as other young youth in the, in the world. You can see a lot of them who want to leave, uh, to find another places uh, more secure, uh, more comfortable for them. They can find work and so on. Many young people here say they like Gaza, just that on the siege there are no opportunities here. Almost anyone who can leaves and so this small Christian community is getting smaller. Malcolm Webb, Al Jazeera in Gaza.